guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video i just like to share with you another strawberry plants that we order um, online so we ordered this on march 20 and then it arrives on the 24th of march ordered this via ebay from the gardener's dream and it cost eight pounds 99 for five uh, bare root uh, plants for one pound eighty each. So this includes postage and package. And um, as you can see, this arrived um, like this in a um, plastic um, package with no protection inside. But um, as you can see, the roots are actually established. They are um, you know good sizes, and they, they really are um, good. So I think they're alright, but it's just that aside from the, the leaves looks a bit sad and you know, and some of them are broken because uh, what would you expect because it just came in in a plastic um, bag with no um, you know proper protection inside but um, hopefully they'll be all right but just to give you um, a background of what is this um, strawberry snow white this is actually also common known as pine berry so this is a white strawberry that tastes like pineapple so it makes sense that they call it pine berry and um, I really want to know if how many of you actually have seen one or even tasted one does it really taste like pineapple so i'm really interested if you have please comment below and um you know but i am really looking forward to actually um you know harvesting one so a pine berry is smaller than a common strawberry measuring between 15 to 23 millimeters when ripe it is almost completely white but with red seeds so you can plant them ideally in pots, hanging baskets, or garden, and you can position them in a full sun. But just um, keep an eye on the soil that it's not going to be too dry. So you have to water them frequently throughout the growing season and weed them as well. Uh, you know, so keep an eye and just make sure there's no insects around them that not uh, you know eating the leaves and keep them away from slugs and snails so like my previous um, strawberry videos that i've mentioned and um, they will also need feeding every two weeks so i have been asked before is it necessary to remove the runners so i would say if it is something um, you know for the plants that's like just newly uh, planted so they're still babies like this one so they're still young Probably I won't let them produce um, runners because, um, you know, that will weaken the plant. So I would say let the plant establish first, maybe keep it for one year until you start producing, um, you know, runners. Because that's what I had I done in my other um, plants. They already an old plant. Then that's when I grow and let them have a lot of runners. So as you can see, they've actually grown a bit now. The leaves is more, you know, the, it's wider, the stems are bigger. So they are doing really well. But, um, you know, at the, at the moment, I have kept them inside because of um, the weather here in the UK has just suddenly dropped and it's really, really cold. So I just don't want uh, to risk of putting them outside. But as soon as I, you know, as, we, as soon as we have a nice weather, I will definitely definitely put them outside to to give them a better chance of um, you know growing just to summarize um, based on how I received the plants through the post I would say I am actually quite disappointed because um, if it is a live plants like that I would have expect that they would have labeled it nicely like the first um, you know, plants that I ordered um, they've labeled it nicely they would have at least put it in a nice uh, extra protective um, casing so if it gets thrown about in a van it won't get damaged but as you have seen on the um, earlier video some of these stems have actually damaged but um, I'm just uh, happy that actually even though uh, they, they came in like that they are growing but um, you know it is just quite slow and um, if you can ask me if it is a uh, good value for money how I received it and how they you know send it to me like that i would say it is overpriced 
so that's it guys and i hope you like this video and if you did please don't forget to click the like button and if you haven't subscribed yet please don't forget to subscribe thanks again everyone hope to see you in my next video bye bye